The Dark Lord knows I serve him, Bellatrix. Then swear to it. Make the unbreakable bow. Will you sever a snap? Swear to watch over Draco. Will you swear that if Draco fails, you will carry out the Dark Lord's orders? I will. Hi, Ginny. Harry, you've been chosen. You're Gryffindor Quidditch captain. I knew you'd get it. You've not flown all summer, though, so you'd better get some practice. Come on, Mr. Chosen One. You can use my broom. Thanks. He should be around here somewhere. I'll see you later. Look, honestly, what? All we need to do is clean them out. You could have done it already if you hadn't had a fourth helping of dinner. I'm starving. When did you get here? About half an hour ago. Didn't Ron tell you? I would have, but you've not let me get a word in. If you'd done these jobs for your mum, I wouldn't have needed to speak to you. Mum wants us to get rid of these cauldrons Fred and George had left in the garage. I'll give you a hand. Oh, that one smells far worse than the others. That's it. Well done. Oh, no. Moving them must have stirred everything up. Quick! Chuck them in the pond! You can't throw them in there. Save them washing them. Who knows what friend George mixed in there? Exactly. Just think of the... the fish! <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know what happens if a fish swallows love potion. 
do you? Maybe they'll fall in love with you. Hermione. Boop. Boop. I love you. Boop. Oh, yes, Ronald. How very grown up of you. Come on, Harry. Let's get rid of those cultures before Mum starts moaning. Wingardium Leviosa! That was brilliant! Wish we could do this after every potions lesson. You did cast that quite well. Great! Let's get rid of the rest of them. have made us clean those out by hand. We'd have still been scrubbing them at Christmas. If you just take the time to learn some cleaning spells. You also spend that time cleaning things up. This was much more fun. Why is Draco sneaking around? I don't know. But that leads to Borgin and Burks. Draco's a Death Eater. It's an initiation ceremony. Why would you know who make that idiot a Death Eater? Why else would Malfoy be in Borgin and Burks? I'm going to find out. And if I use the invisibility cloak, he'll never know I was listening in. Will he? You go on. I want to check something. Petrificus Totalus! Sneaking about listening in, were you, Potter? I knew I'd seen someone climb up there. Well, <clears throat> enjoy, enjoy the, the trip, trip back, back to, to London, London and Potter. Potter. I was trying to find out what Malfoy's up to. I'm sure he's a Death Eater. I was wearing my invisibility cloak, but he must have seen me when I climbed onto the luggage rack. Maybe he saw your Raxperts. My... what? Raxperts? Was he wearing Spectra Specs? You can see Raxperts through them. That's how I found you. Your brain's full of them. Right. Let's get to the castle. We're probably already in trouble for being late. Okay. Although I'm worried about tripping over things in the dark. Maybe we should use Lumos. What's that? How exciting! A mystery! And we've only just got back. Let's pick it up! It's a crack. That's nice. I wonder if there are any more of them. Let's go and find out. I got another one. Oh, well done. That's three. That's nice. We could make a sort of collection of them. Are you looking for blue green hundings? You won't find them. It isn't the kind of year for you.
I wonder what Dumbledore will say in his speech this year. As you know, each day, dark forces are attempting to penetrate this castle. For this reason, I have agreed that the Dueling Club will restart this year. Now, please What's join me to in welcoming hand? Horace Slughorn, who will resume his old position of Potions Master. Meanwhile, the position of Defense Against the Dark Arts teacher will be assumed by Professor Snape. No! How can Dumbledore let him after all he's done? I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. Mischief managed. Well, there's one good thing. The defense against the dark arts jobs jinxed. Snape will be gone by the end of the year, and personally, I'm keeping my fingers crossed for another death. I would have thought you would be at potions, Mr. Potter. Or is it no longer your ambition to become an Aura? I was told I had to get an outstanding in my OWL. And so you did when Professor Snape was teaching the subject. But Professor Slughorn is perfectly happy to accept students with exceeds expectations at OWL, however. Brilliant. I'll head there straight away. But I don't want to do potions. I'm dead awful at potions. I don't know how to get there with half the castle locked by the Auras. I'd ask nearly head to Snick. He can still get around, so he knows all the shortcuts. Harry! Bloody hell! And how are we this new term? All fired up and ready to win the Quidditch Cup for Gryffindor again, I hope? Yeah, but right now I need to get to potions. Do you know a way around these security arrangements? But of course, just follow me. It'll be a pleasure to help out. At least Potions isn't with Snape this year. I wonder what Slughorn is like. I'm sure they'll find it. Would you like to stop and get that crest, Harry? Wingardium Leviosa! Thanks, Nick. We Gryffindors must stick together. Anytime you're stuck and need directions, advice, information, just call out and I'll help if I can. Of all the ghosts Gryffindor get Nick, 
He couldn't even get his head cut off properly. He got us here, didn't he? Harry, my boy. I was beginning to worry. Sorry we're late, sir. And I'm afraid Ron and I haven't got books yet. <laughs> Not to worry. You can get what you need from over there. A simple little potion to ease us into the year, I think. Open up your books and let's get busy with a witch-sharpening potion, shall we? Hermione, um, witch-sharpening potion? We made it in our fourth year. Just do what I do. Armadillo bile. Great! Let's add some of this. Let's add some of this. This is great. There are definitely days I could do with some of this. Granger, Harry, well done, my boy. Well, now we have our juices flowing. Let us turn to the cure for boils. What's this one? Oh, Harry, it's a first-year potion. Have you forgotten all your revision? little potion, this one. At least it is in the making of it. But be careful not to let things get too hot. A hole in your cauldron can be expensive and painful. Almost there. Keep up the good work. Flobber one mucus. Excellent! Snake fangs. Luckily, cowards will no longer attach to the snake and porcupine bells. Hey, someone's written a note on this. Red is for beginners. Heat until the potion goes pink. That's just a student's note. It can't be the proper way to make it, or they would have printed it in the book. Yeah, but... Well, I'm going to try these notes. Oh, 
Aha! Not bad, not bad at all. My, 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 Harry. Pink? Uh, uh, yes. I must have... No, no, red is, of course, the basic potion. But pink, excellent. You have the makings of a master potion maker. You should be ready for something a little more complicated then, yes? Let us try the draft of living death. I told you to make it go pink. Sir, you haven't told us what's in that little golden bottle. Ah, what you see here is Felix Felicis, more commonly known as Liquid Luck. One sip and you will find all your endeavors succeed. And this I offer today to the student who brews an acceptable draft of living death, a small vial of liquid luck. So gather your ingredients, but keep your eyes on the clock. Good luck. I can whisper these notes to you. No, thank you. My instructions are perfectly adequate. Suit yourself. Sopophorus beans. Very well, my boy. Sloth brain. Granger, now. Excellent, Harry. It's clear you've inherited your mother's talent. She was a dab hand at potions. But this, here as promised, one bottle of liquid luck. Use it well. Blimey, Harry. You've been doing Hermione and revising all summer? No, it's the textbook I borrowed. It's got notes all over it. I just followed their instructions. Huh? You don't need a potion to be lucky. I mean, I could have picked that book, but no. I get the one that looks like it's been puked on. Harry Potter? Look, he's not talking about the prophecy, he's not talking about the Daily Prophet, and he won't give you his autograph. So clear off, Pipsqueak. No! You've been invited to join the Gryffindor Dueling Club in the Great Hall. Oh, right. Thanks, sorry. It's okay. Oh, Professor McGonagall said to tell you there's a shortcut to the Great Hall behind that portrait. The password is Libraries Liberate. Dueling Club? You should be brilliant at that. All the DA members should. Let's go and see if any of them are joining. 